Welcome to another Business Tech Planet video. Today, we'll find out if other people know when you edit a message in Teams. First, we'll look at what the other person sees. Then we'll discuss what information is saved by Teams. And then we'll show you how to find edited messages. Here are two chat windows in Teams, where the left has sent a message to the right. To edit the message, hover over it and click the three dots. Then select edit from the pop-up menu. You can now change the message. And when you're done, hit the check mark. Once you edit the message, the word edited will appear above it and will be visible to both the sender and receiver. However, unlike deleted messages, if you go to the recent chats, you'll notice there's no indication the message has changed. But while users can't see edited messages, admins can. So let's look at what type of data Teams can retain. Teams saves the following data types. Card content. Chat messages. Deleted messages. Edited messages. Images, including emojis, stickers, and GIFs. And also the other content listed below. Teams doesn't save audio. Code snippets. Feed notifications, or reactions. If you're a global admin, you can view edited messages by opening the admin center. There, click the menu icon in the top left. Then go down and click show wall to reveal more options. Now select compliance from the list of admin centers. When the compliance center opens, go to the left menu and click content search. In content search, click new search at the top. Give your search a name, such as search edited messages. When you're done, hit next at the bottom. Now toggle exchange mailboxes on. And then hit next. It's best to narrow down the search using a date condition. So click add condition, then select date from the pop-up list. Click the calendar icons to select a specific date. When you're done, hit next. And then hit submit on the next page. Finally, hit done. Now click the search you just created. In the flyout pane, click review sample. This may take a while, depending on how much data you're searching for. But once the sample opens, you can see the original message we posted. and also the new message, after it was changed. That's all for this video. If you found it helpful, why not buy us a coffee? We'd really appreciate it. And, you'd be helping us grow the channel. Remember to check the description for additional links and resources. And don't forget to subscribe for more Microsoft videos.